tutorial club. And these are the questions from the Ask Anything chat. I'm going to try to answer them. Yeah. And if they're awkward questions, we're just going to ignore them. Yeah. So Lonnie from Cincinnati, how many clubs do you play a year? They just did an article about this, actually. We're in the, we're in the top three when it comes to like doing the most shows. Yeah. I think it was, the number was like around, was it 150 or 180? A lot. A lot. <laughs> <laughs> um, Barbara from Daytona Beach. Um, Shout out to Daytona Beach. How often do you have to replace your equipment? The good thing is, it's always the equipment of the club. And yes, we um, sometimes partly destroy it. Yeah. But uh, so just we're just gone the next day. So it's, it's sometimes for fun, when you don't watch yeah, it, just yeah. kick it. Like, ugh. So never. Carrie from Kari, Carrie from Venice. This is for Nizzle. How many times do people modify your <laughs> name when they call you? Do you get a lot of drizzle, drizzle my nizzle jokes? Like bad jokes? Or like, <laughs> um, no, not a lot actually. Most people call me Nils. I call you a dickhead. <laughs> <laughs> no, you don't. No, just this once. <laughs> Uh, this is just your question. I'm not even involved in this. <laughs> true, I'm true. I'm sorry. I'm, so I'm sorry about this. Step out and, uh... No, this is you actually, Jacqueline. Oh, I thought you were still on the fence. I thought I thought it said Jacqueline from Entourage. I was like, <laughs> there's no there's no Jacqueline in Entourage. I watched it like last week, all seasons, and you know Anchorage. the album is done, so we have time to like like watch some series again. But this is Jacqueline from Anchorage. Sounds How? like it's in Canada, but mm. I don't know. Yeah. Anchorage. Yeah. Is that you know what it is? It's Anchorage, Alaska. Alaska? Yeah. Oh, Isn't there cool. an Anchorage in Star Wars too? That's probably where it is. I think that's uh, the, the, <laughs> the town where like the famous uh, words... Uh, but the question. These are not the droids you're looking for. But I think the question. That's How did you come up with Los Amsterdam? Well, yeah. that's actually a really hard one. Uh, we did half of the album in Los Angeles and the other half in Amsterdam. Boom! <laughs> Do the math. Mind is blown. It's crazy, yes. Okay. Okay, Judy. From Brick Church? <laughs> I just want to say, Brick Church! But this is Judy. Can Brick you give Church? us a few words about these songs? Invitation, Love and War, Good Day. Uh, Invitation is a sex song. It's all about uh, sexual feelings. Yeah, but and in a subtle way. Oh, definitely. Yeah. But uh, that's, uh, you know, yeah. if I talk about sex, it's always in a it's subtle It's always subtle, actually. Um, that's right. So, yeah. Sorry about when, that. Um, if you're feeling like... In a sexy movie, do you? If you're feeling like subtle sexy. Subtle sexy, yeah. <laughs> not if you're like in a, in a whoring mood, then it's not your song. No, not then at we got, all. We've got different songs for that. Yes. Love and War. A few words about that song. What should we say about that song? Um, what can I feel very about? passionate about that song. I think it's... Um, I, I feel very, um, how do you say that? I just love the drop on that song, just because <laughs> just it's like, I just I was like say, well, everything else is like, you know, is not that good, <laughs> actually. But <laughs> I was going to say, I really feel, uh, I, really, I really think those lyrics um, hit a, a certain spot. And yeah. I know a lot of people feel that way when we drop the song. A lot of people like, uh, this is about me or uh, yeah. whatever. And like, like it is, like, it's yeah. love and war. What exactly. Can I say? Take a step forward. Could I? I'm yeah. trying to step out of this. No, book. no, you're good. You, I just want to make sure. Because then you both be in focus. So I just want to make sure yeah, that yeah. I'm in. Cool, and cool. you're good, you're good. Yeah, Good Day. Good Day is just, it's just another offspring of, uh, of, of this long lasting collaboration with DJ Snake. And, you know, that always feels good. And this is something really refreshing. We didn't do something like this before, you know. So after Ocho Cinco, you know, this, this felt good. Felt logical. Felt logical. Felt subtle. Subtle too. <laughs> Gina from Rockford. Gina. Um, Rockford. Never heard of it. Never been there. Has a club or venue ever been too loud for you? And what do you consider too loud? No. 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 The other way around? Yes. Certain clubs have asked us to stop DJing or be less loud. 